All right, so this is our third attempt with the trucks at New Hampshire. This is the fixed series. We ended up qualifying third in this one with 30.7, so not too bad of a time. All right, fellas, get ready to roll here. Remember, guys, we can't win this thing on the first lap. And we're, we're definitely smart. not going to make a mistake like we did in the last the one. Girl, wow, five of them. The <laughs> and myself ran on. the it's same exact time. That's hilarious. But, yeah, our mistake last time was beating off a pit road. First time I've really ever done that. That was just totally forgot about it. I don't know why. I just wanted to get off quick. I didn't want to lose positions. We have I ended up completely speeding and dropped to the back. And that led from, I think we were in like 7th or 8th at the time, all the way to 16th. Quite a few guys didn't qualify, including the one here. Like we're starting before the pace car even. And our other mistake was around halfway we also didn't come in to pit for tires. And that just caused us to drop like a rock. And the one car that was racing with us, he dropped as well, so I know it just wasn't my bad driving or anything. It uh, definitely was tires. So we're going to make sure that doesn't happen, especially if this does run a lot of cautions like the last one did. But uh, hopefully we just get green flag racing. And won't even have to worry about it. I'm going to try and pull away as decently quick as possible because I don't want to be around everybody in this. Drive it in pretty deep. Clear high, clear high. Outside. Pretty smooth there. Five kind of hits the wall, I think, or something. 18 and 12 drive a little bit higher into the turn. We keep it center. So far, it's green. Drive it in way too hard there. That might actually cost us some time. Do get a pretty good run off the corner. I don't know if I want to pass the 18 just yet. So we're just going to lay low and keep it nice and smooth. And that's not going to cause a caution. He just spun, it looks like. Well, and the 18 aren't really racing each other yet, which is what we want. We want to pull away. I come off the gas way sooner than everyone else, but that also allows me to get a really good run midway through the corner. And I drop right up behind them. 31.03. And try the high line. Maybe that'll help save tires a bit, but it also gets us a little loose there. If I wanted to, I probably could pass them right there, but don't want to just yet. We're only lap four in this thing, so... Definitely just playing the patience game. And there's our caution. First one. Lot five, so not as bad as I thought it was going to be. And I also like being in third because I'll be on the inside again. So, if we are going to pit, we're not getting fuel. It's tires. Let's see how many people.
people that involves. We got one lap down. That was a guy we saw on the inside there. Not really sure. Maybe it was just a self spin. The road is open. Doesn't look like it was bad though. A lot of people like jump in the start, eh? I know that. Maybe jump in the start. We're we coming they in. Not, no. Like they do hang way nope, back. Nope, we're not coming in. Get ahead to like your meet at speed, fucking. They just fly in. And fucking everybody's going to normal speed, and then somebody just comes flying in, you know? That's for yeah, for someone's for not for happy for with the way people are driving. 14, get the lucky dog. I mean, that's have a lab again. car coming uh, outside. Coming on the outside. I'm assuming he's getting his lap back here. As long as the leader has gone, you can improve your position on the outside. Also. You're going to be lining up behind the 14. Okay, so it's better to hang back and not be tight to a car. So you want like five car lines so you can get a fucking boom and start. But yeah, we are going to be starting, like I said, in third on the inside line. That guy got his lap back. So we will be all on the lead lap. You're in the back of the pack, yeah. Middle of the pack, I don't think it's hard to have five car lines. Oh, let's see here. The road's closed. Usually the guys jump in the start to have no talent anyway. Oh, what can I do here? Just <laughs> playing around with this. It should. Make it so I can't hear them. But I think they're done expressing their anger toward each other. Very clean in the front here, though. I was very shocked. Way better than the last one, to be honest. I'm not surprised they didn't go in for tires. Side, I think. Okay, well, let's see. This definitely lets you uh, improve on your restarts. Especially when you got so many cautions in a series like this. Wonder if the open setup is any different. Kind of jump up there a bit. I'm not sure why we weren't closer to the pace car to begin with, but it's fine. The guy behind us is pretty close to our back. Uh, we're just going to try and go right when this leader does. There we go. We had a real good start. Owens obviously to our side. Remember, we don't want to overdrive it. Be the one guy back there, go you know, flying up almost into the wall. Don't really want to pass the 18 just yet. Is if the 7 starts to get closer to us. And he really kind of messes the turn up. Wow, we get turned down really low here. It'll be fine. I don't want to open that door for the 7. So I'd we'll back off a little bit sooner than them. Let them run that high side. Woo! 
get a little loose there, that's fine. That's manageable loose, it's not where you're going to lose it completely. Definitely could be driving it harder, but like I said, trying to conserve the tires a bit because the last race we got extremely extremely tight. And I don't want that happening again because Granted, last race we didn't take tires, so that was also a deciding factor in that. But I guess this way will also allow us to gauge who is burning their tires up quicker run in that middle line or the top line. And now getting a little loose on corner exit definitely isn't helping the tires too much. But I think it's more mid-corner that you're really gonna say we're getting loose there. Holding on to it, nice. Oh, and there's our next caution. Now we're probably gonna get tires. Yeah, this is about the same time we had a caution last race. And that's when pretty much the whole field took tires besides Three of us. Oh my god. Okay, we're coming in real bad here. Now remember, we don't want to lose positions here. Let's try and keep it right at that 45. I'll even come down right here. Really don't want to get taken out. There we go. Beautiful. Two tires, man. Go, man, go, go, man, go. It road speed. We got one more set of tires. That's it. Is that a, what is that laying up your road right now? Okay, so, eight definitely took two yeah, well, tires on that. What that is, we don't get flat leaving. Yeah. Other than that, we came out the same place we are now, or were before. So, if the rest of this race goes clean for us, I definitely think we can secure a top three finish here. One to go. So you should be on the outside. We're gonna restart oh, the problem. That's one. going nine, to two, seven, five. Well, it says we're in fifth. Why are we on the outside line? Looks like you sure. should be lining up behind the 12. Okay, there we go. 18 was... Break a hold of your tires. 18 was in the wrong lane. Since the start of the race. Huh. So, let's see what two tires does for the 19. Everyone's really close behind us. Let's just hopefully get away from them. I don't want to be near that. Let's take the high lane here. I know we can be pretty quick on that high lane. Especially in the start. It's 
like the 12's already going for... Oh, caution! Closed right now. So the 19 already gets passed by the 12 on new tires. And we're unfortunately still in fourth. Yeah, that was New tires really just send everybody a self spin because they look extremely cold. And I think he's going in for tires. <laughs> Honestly, if I was him, I'd probably just stay out and try and hold on to the positions, but sometimes it's more dangerous than anything. Hopefully after this we could just get a nice green run all the way to the finish. What are... What's everyone doing? Lining up behind the pace car. <laughs> I don't know, that's funny. We all acting like we're gonna pit. <laughs> oh my god. Closed. They wrote the closed. <laughs> that's too funny. That would be probably the worst decision <laughs> to do that. We should be dropping all the way back to 18. We gotta be halfway, like half back to the track or whatever. Dropping in second. We're getting a real fucking jump start on this one. We're gonna be in fourth gear and we're just getting out of fucking getting into fourth. And let's see. No one behind us has damage, so that's reassuring. Hell yeah, boys, we don't stop the smell shit of your glass. No incidents. Best lap was 31 seconds, so not as quick as qualifying, but never is. And look at us. Inside line again. Just watch your inside going into turn one. We see that here a lot, guys. Dive into the inside. Inside line, right where I want to be. And we might try and pass the 18 with about 10 to go. It all really depends on if we can get a good run on him or not. So I have to take into account that we still do have cold tires. No way a half a lap or even a full lap is going to warm them up. You both felt a good time, man. So we're going to get right on its back. Pace car's off. Be ready. Oh, he's kind of. Kind of a bad start, but hopefully we can just drop it in nice, not let anybody on our inside. 18's going to probably try and drop down to block me. Woo! We get loose off the corner there. A lot of guys really do send it in hard there. Once you get a good run on the straight, but 
I don't think it's the best option because it's going to be chewing up your tires. Ooh, seven hits the wall behind us. I think the seven could have passed us, but he kind of was backing off there a bit. Yeah, we're definitely using that looseness on corner exit to help us turn. We got a really good. Really good exit. Yeah, I can put some gas in in the middle of the corner and then send it through. Kind of back off a little bit quick, sooner than I thought they would. And remember, I don't want to hit the 18. Whoa, we get loose. We get very loose, and that's probably going to cost us the position. Clear high. Keep there outside. Right outside. All around. We are definitely not making that three wide. Well, that slides us back to port. And now we kind of drive it a little bit harder. Luckily we don't lose it or anything. Oh my god, they all go into the wall behind us. That is exactly why. I do not want to be back there. That leaves a massive gap now. Definitely works better for us if we come into the turn a little bit slower. should be able to get fourth as long as we don't make any really bad mistakes. So they're 2.2 seconds behind us. Leaders are fighting for a position. Oh, and we got a caution. That's not what we needed, actually. <laughs> Let's see if everyone goes in for new tires. Alright, buddy. Line up behind the 11. It's definitely, we're not feeling too good. What is 6 doing? Look at the case. Oh my god, okay, I guess we're not going in. Well, So, I guess that's another position for us. I think you got the wrong pair. Hey, you're talking number two, I think. I don't know. I was right there with five. They like could be lining up behind the one. I don't know if... I was side by side with the five. I was in the room. If that guy got tricked into going in, or if he actually did want to go in, but... I feel like he's going to lose a lot of positions now. I am, yeah. Okay, 
hundred percent do that. Yeah. He's wrecked everybody, man. He's gotta have a 16X right now. So that puts us back in third on the inside line, exactly where we want to be. I look down at my relative that would help. Especially when we're only going to have, what, like, three laps to go? Three, four laps? I don't want to stay away from the 6 just because I feel like he might overdrive it. He was the one that bumped the wall before, so... But he will be on our outside, which is perfect. Yeah, he's very sporadic on the gas. Kind of worries me. It's one. What one is go. he doing? He'll be lining up on the inside. One minute seven point eight two nine. Jesus. Yeah, I do not want to be around him. in the back of the bumper of the 12. Not too close, but just enough to where we can get a really good start and hopefully just get away from the 6. As you're running around out there, just take notice of where the shade is on the racetrack. You go right ahead. Yeah, the guy behind us has quite a bit of damage. Got a pretty bad start. Too worried about the six though. Maybe we overdrive. Oh, we're pushing him up. We pushed him up real bad. And you know what? Let him just go. We'll see what happens here in this next turn. Truck feels really good there. Maybe I was the one that was pushing up too much. Oh my god, there's the yellow. And that's going to finish this race off. E4. Actually, I don't know. Do we have green-white checkers here? Because if we do, then it might not be what we think. This is Class C, so open, open. might just be, actually. In that case, we're definitely not done. Why the 12 keeps doing that? Freaking everybody out. Yeah, but I was there. Okay, so we are going to have a green-white checker, it looks like. 
14. Got the lucky dog. And we're gonna have one coming to the outside. And we'll be on the outside, unfortunately. We're on the outside, God. But the outside might actually do us I've better. I've only done this about 20 times on y'all, I'm sorry. Levin's up there, he's gonna go ran over. Get behind the 14. So, now everybody's gonna be even racing harder. Which we might see an accident. Pretty good chance. So the key is going to be not to overdrive into turn one, especially on the high side because once you hit the wall you're going to lose quite a few positions. Other trick is going to be not getting run over and also getting a good start because the last one we did not. That was pretty bad. The leader started in first, but it seemed like it. I don't know what's gonna be a little bit quicker. Are they coming to the green right now, Earl? Yeah. Earl, are they coming to the green this time? Yeah, on one to go. One. Try second. Point six, eight, nine. I don't know. Like. It feels pretty much the same. 12 did get a really good run on that last restart. <laughs> Six score <laughs> has been uh, beat up a bit. Probably just falling behind them, to be honest. That way I know we're not going to get pushed into or anything because... I drove it in pretty slow in turn right, one last we'll time, and even then, well. it still pushed here. up really far into the six. Base cars off. You ready? Oh my God, we are almost touching it. Pretty good start. Six might get a good run into this corner. Cuts down way low there. That almost. Yeah. I'll get you turned. Oh my god. Another caution. We got a bit of a here in the pit, guys. Let's make White flag. Yeah. Close. Looks like you're going to be lining up behind 11. Nice win, 12. And that's going to end it. We're going to restart behind the 11. And there it is. We get P4. Not too bad. P4, zero incidents. Pretty good race. Checker flag is out. A great job, baby. Behind the 11. Lighting up behind the safe car. Yeah, we're just going to pull off to the side of here. Let's see all the accidents in this one, because we had quite a few cautions.
Five car. Hitting the wall pretty hard. Five car, I'm guessing, hitting the wall again. Bumps to seven. And then hits the wall. Fourteen, losing it on the front. This really should have been a caution. Oh my god, and he hits the wall again. And then this is where we all come flying by him. Seventeen, touching the wall. Twenty, oh, gets turned by the ten. sure what happens here. Doesn't look like anything. Two car coming. Oh, and it's tapped. Doesn't lose it, but still a pretty nasty hit. Two coming back. Oh, these guys just hit into each other then. It's to him. Oh lord, okay. 16 in the wall. Ten just blasting into him. That was definitely avoidable. Thirteen. Not sure what happens. Seven hitting the wall. There we go. That's what led to that huge gap. Nineteen, I'm guessing, tap the wall. Fifteen, tap on the wall. Six again ran over into the wall. No, it wasn't his fault actually. Why he had all that damage. The two is just running into everything. I'm guessing the six is not happy about that. Oh yeah, he's definitely not happy with the two. Two comes back on strong, but can't get to him. Kinda interested to see what happens in this next turn. Right on his bumper. There we go, hits the wall, and he's finally away from the six. Seven, coming in pretty... Oh my god, it's the two again. Oh my god, he has seriously wrecked so many people. That really stinks for the seven. That's why I did not want to be back there. Let's see who else the two can wreck. Was on that restart. Oh yeah, we just barely touch. That's fine. Didn't really affect us in any way. And he got the position anyways. Oh, 18, hitting it at 13. The 18 is trying to get back from that pit stop he made, and then there's a wreck, 
gates and get involved in it. He does. Oh, and he gets wrecked out in it. Oh, that was a nasty wreck. That really stinks for the 18. That was a lap. That was right near the end, probably like lap 30 some. And I think this brought out our last. Oh my god, the 18 gets taken out again. His oh, and the 7 too. Oh my god. What just happened there? Yeah, I think being in the back is not where you want to be in these races. Wow. I'm just interested to see what the two does now. Oh my god, he gets absolutely murdered by the seven. Yeah, the seven is not happy with the two. That was horrendous driving from the two, and... Shouldn't be even racing in C-Class. But, that's going to be it for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.